I don't really think she needs clothes. She's totally naked. Oh my god. Hello everyone. I'm an artist and I love playing Elden Ring. While playing, I had an idea. What if I redraw Elden Ring bosses as anime girls? So now in this video, I will attempt to redraw these brutal, super strong demigods as anime girls. So let's choose the first boss to draw. There are plenty of bosses in Elden Ring, but I decided on Rodan. However, since he's entirely covered in armor, it will be very hard to recognize any changes. So I'd like to focus on Margit the Fallen Omen instead. And first I want to decide on a pose. So I used all my creativity and selected his default pose from pictures on Google. And now when we have our references, let's start sketching. So I want her to hold his stuff. It's a stuff. Maybe. And in her left hand she will hold uh, this holy magic blade. I was really confused when he threw this blade in me for the first time and I just like what is going on and then it just like Also I want her to wear this cape he wears and maybe we can create some composition with uh, this stuff like uh, this cape covering this stuff and it's in shadow so let's move on the hair now and i want it to be a little longer than in the game because she is a girl but she don't looks like and i want her to have haughty hairstyle okay so we have this beautiful line art and now we can start shading by adding the base colors after that i'd like to add a dark blue gradient on her legs because Margit has fur on his legs, or what is that, uh, which is giving them a dark blue color. But I don't want it to be too dark, so I will just apply a light gradient uh, with a soft brush. Next I will add some shading with light and shadows. And then I will color the line art to bring some harmony to the artwork. Actually coloring the line art a uh, not really bad idea, because it looks much more better than leaving it with just black lines. Also when I was drawing hands I just like... And as a final touches I want to add her hair like behind her and it's blowing because the wind. Okay, I'm lying. Actually, that was not a final touches, because the next day I opened this file, I noticed how dirty it looks, so let's clean up this a little, and I want to add a normal light direction, because here we don't understand where the light going from, so it will be from behind of her, and also this magic blade, it must be shiny, like a sun. So we need to add a light around of this blade and a little bit of light on this stuff. So yes, and also shadow under her legs on the ground. Then I add some small details and are you ready for that masterpiece? So here is the result. So first Here's the original Margit from the game and here's his female version. Like it's not really bad but I think it don't look like a female. He just has a long hair. But just let's go to the next. So for the next, I'd like to choose the worst, the hardest boss in the game. No, it's not a Malenia, it's the Airtree Watchdogs. Just imagine, you're starting the game exploring the catacombs, and you encounter this. 
and you don't even have a normal weapon and then you just like okay let's go back to drawing so first i tried some poses but ended up redrawing the pose from the game and i started with basic shapes like circles and ellipses to simplify body shapes so the pose uh she's sitting like a cat and i add some dynamic with her leg she had forward and also she has a cloak like a market so i decided to make it blow to add some dynamic and it looks like she jumped after being hit or blocked i don't know so also i don't understand why it's called a watchdogs because it looks more like a cat it's have ears and long tail like a cat i think i can add some fire at the end of her tail similar to the boss in the game so now i have to finish with the line art and i give her this creepy and angry face like she's really defending her catacombs and of course she had this big sword and also i want to make her a little muscular since she's a catacomb watcher so now i'm done with the base colors and she's totally naked oh my god so now let's give her some clothes uh, i decided to on something light because she's like a female warrior but i don't really think she needs clothes but since we are on youtube i'll give her some underwear and also i give her some bracelets as accessories on her legs and hands like some ancient artifacts and now i start rendering by adding shadow and light and i thought it looked okay but when i took a break and came back to it i was like So now I will fix everything and I will add some rim light and correct the wall pose because now she looks like... So first the rim light and after that I want to make shadows on her skin more intense. And after all this I grabbed a blending brush and blended the shadows in the round places. So. It's how it looks before blending and after. And as the final touch I added a shadow on the ground. And now I want to correct her pose with a liquify tool after merging all layers. So this is the boss from the game and this is what I created. So very angry cat girl who's actually a watchdog with a sword from Berserk. That's everything I draw in this video, hope you like both of these pieces and thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe on my channel for more videos like this and if you have any good ideas for videos I'm always waiting for you in the comments below.